Hey, what's going on everyone? Wally here, and we are back with some more Dauntless gameplay. Today we are going to be going on our first Dire Patrol. So with the Dire Patrol, there are five different behemoths that you can encounter. You can encounter the Moon Reaver Shrike, which is who we're actually going to be fighting in this battle, the Rage Del Nasher, Firebrand Charog, the Rockfell Skarn, or the new Radiant Behemoth, Valomir. So in this game here, we're actually going to be just taking our highest level gear. So we've got a couple of sets that are at 300, which is the max until you actually complete some of these. Because you actually need to acquire the dual arc stones in order to fully, not fully level up your gear, but level up your gear to the next set of powers. So we're going to go in here and take this guy on using some random gear that just has some components on it that I like. And then we're also going to be using the Onus of Boris. To, oh, that's gonna hurt. Okay. Because I wanted to mix it up here, I do use my repeaters quite often, and I do like using them, but the sword is a great weapon, and it's really versatile. And this guy is actually really, really fast, too. And a simple heavy attack will actually knock him out of the air, so we're gonna try and use that. See if we can, uh, negate some of his damage. But, being a dire, oh my god, that was right through that. A Dire Patrol. This guy is obviously going to be different than the last version we faced, so I don't know what to expect with this. So we're just going to hope for the best here, guys. Oh, oh my gosh. I'm going to get lucky here with these dodges. This guy does look really cool. I must admit that. Alright. I will tell you, though, that we are draining some stamina here pretty quick. I'm about to get Valiant Overdrive, which is awesome. But I'm going to wait till he's staggered if I can. Oh, that actually hit me. Oh my god, that is a massive amount of damage. I'm hoping he flies. And then we can use it. I would love the Molten Heart here. Okay. I think we're going to do this. He's actually swinging on up here. I think this would be really good. So we're going to use Valiant Overdrive. I'm going to go for the, the damage here. Whoa. Woo, that was close. I actually might spend more time chasing this guy down than I will get to actually... Oh, I wish we would have landed a heavy attack there. If I can get some extra damage done on the last bit here. Didn't get too much done. I do like these Molten Hearts that are dropping, though. It does give us a little bit more DPS. Now, if we can get the stagger on this guy, that'd be awesome. Ah, dang, I'm too slow here. If we can go for the headshot... There we go. That's what we needed, was that headshot here, just to get a nice little stagger going. I really want those Molten Hearts, but I'm going to wait to back it up until he slams the ground. Oh, I backed up right into him, too. We're going to heal up here, guys. And we're going to wait to re-engage. Nice dodge. Oh, the double slam. Oh, man, that's what I get for talking too soon. That was so brutal. The damage that this guy does is insane. So we're actually going to use a stamina potion here, because I am getting drained pretty often. Now, if I can get him to chase after me, I want to land a sweet heavy attack. This guy's actually pretty easy to stagger, or at least his weaker counterpart is. I'm sure it'll work the same. Oh, we gotta back up. Oh, that hurt. Being enraged, I'm sure he's going to go for this here. I need him to swoop in and wolf for the heavy attack. Oh, okay. Well, we did hit him, but he took us with him. Okay, we're gonna dash in here. Try and lay down as much damage as possible. Avoid this hurricane, please, and thank you. Oh, okay, we dodged that. There we go. There we are, guys. So the great thing about Overdrive is you don't get staggered, but you do take an immense amount of damage, so... We gotta be careful. We're actually already down to two pots here. He is still getting staggered, and we're dropping some Molten Hearts, which is really good. This guy's pissed off, that's for sure. Oh, I almost rolled right into that. He almost ate me for breakfast. I think he's going to come. Maybe not. Alright, let's see if we can get this guy. The repeaters probably would have been safer than this, to be honest with you. But, oh my god, yeah, that's right. He uses the double slam. And that is brutal. Oh my god, that would have been my face. He literally almost slit my throat. Alright, we well, don't want to get knocked. That would be really, really bad. I'm going to see if I can make it over to the health pack here. Now, of course, he sees me, and he's probably going to try and stop me. Let's see if I can get over here. One. Two. There we go. Let's see if we can do some damage to this guy. Chop off these feathers here. 
All right, I think he'll probably dodge that. Good. Now I need him to fly in the air and come at me. Oh, oh yep. Got to remember that double set pound. That is a new ability this guy has compared to his pattern parts here. There we go. Come on, fly, friend. Let me stagger you. That was really weird. He like short flew and then jumped on the guys. Oh, that was that was rough. This guy is really really unpredictable. I can tell you that. All right, let's see if I can get on over here. Oh, come on. He's going to fly away as I get my Valiant Overdrive. That's lame. But the great thing about the Flying Behemoths is it's pretty obvious where they go. So we're going to just follow him on up here, even though I'm not super excited to follow this guy because he just kind of kicked my butt here. Um, we're going to let my team know that I found him. Hopefully he doesn't throw anything at my face in the meantime. And he sure did. All right. We're going to heal up here. I don't have overdrive. I'm going to wait to use my final damage pot here until I have my overdrive ready. There's that in the second pound. Okay, we're going to go in for the kill here. There we are. Woo! Oh, it's going to hurt. It's going to tickle. Oh, no. Stop beating me up, dude. Jesus Christ. He literally just, like, one-shot me. Now, I can try and res myself, but... We'll see. Don't everyone stand in the same spot at once, that's for sure. I think he's going to heal instead of picking me up. I'm in a really bad spot here. Alright. Oh, no, actually, he did get me, and that's really cool. Awesome. I didn't think that was going to actually happen. I thought possibly the game would make things hard for us here. I just dropped my fireball here. And hopefully, because he's staying there long enough, he should take that damage. Yeah, he did. Cool. Let's see if I can get him here. He throws the hurricane out, and then he dodges. So, er, then he comes flying at you, so he makes it really hard to land that staggering hit. This is a lot more intense than previously. Now he's showing, throwing, like, fire... I don't know what they are. Yeah, let's watch this. All right, let's get in here. This guy is a savage, I can tell you that. Oh, no, don't get it by that, please. Ooh, okay. We haven't done any damage here in the last moment, though. Maybe... Ah, Jesus. He is so unpredictable. As long as that doesn't hit me, we're good. That's gonna hit me. Oh, nope. Okay. He will come back, though. Did I get him? Nah, I didn't get him. That's lame. Gotta be careful for that second ground pound here. Ah, oh, Jesus. He is really out to get me. Woo! Alright, I can't, I can't afford to get downed again. Especially since we're in the second half of the fight, and I'm sure he's in a... Lay down some brutal, brutal damage here. All right, we're just about to get overdrive, so I think we're gonna pop our potion. Yeah, we are. Okay, we're gonna back it up because I know he's going for it, and we're gonna go for the kill here. There we go. Oh, I missed him. That's lame. Where'd you go, friend? There we go. Oh, it really hurts. There we go, get that stagger down. Drop the fireball too. So that should blow up here in a moment, yep. Let's see if he comes running at us. Maybe? We'll see what happens. We're all really close to him, so I doubt it. Oh, he's gonna get enraged again, he's pissed. Alright, let's see here. I think I can get him if he comes here now. We gotta, we gotta wait for the hurricane and then go for the kill. Ah, jeez, that's hard. I got it. There we go. Finally, I landed it, guys. That is what matters, is when you can stagger him like that and just get a moment to just lay down a bunch of damage. It doesn't last very long. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Damn, that looks like it hurt. <laughs> All right, we're going to heal up here. One final potion here. What is this green thing on the ground? Uh, oh, three dual arc stones. He just randomly dropped those for us. That's cool. And it looks like this guy kind of just did a somersault. I don't know what is going on here. Gotta dodge that, and then he's gonna obviously come in for the flying attack. So I need to wait. Oh, nice, nice, nice uh, stagger here, friend. Oh, gotta dodge. Alright, that's the second pound here. We're doing a great job avoiding the hurricanes, but that is not his only attack. Oh, that hurts me so bad. Because I know how much damage that does. His head's actually boiling here. If they can land that, that'd be huge. There we go. Now, I'm going to use my 
Oh, that really hurt. Oh, that really hurt. That really, really sucks. I gotta, I gotta pick myself up here. That sucks. That really sucks. Let's see if I can get, get some damage here. I am one shot away from getting down again here, guys. This guy is a monster. Oop, okay, that was close. Oh, he's coming for me. Okay. Alright, that double grand slam here. If we can land a stagger. Come on, buddy. Come on, one more. Nope, not digging it. Well, at least we're, at least we're getting some. There we go. I think that may be it. Maybe. He's standing still when he's fallen. I think we just won the hunt here, guys. Yes, we did. My god, that was intense. That was a lot crazier than some of these previous hunts here. We actually got an S double plus, guys. Don't ask me how we got downed, I think, once. No, twice, I do believe here. And we also had to go through all five pots. Let's see what happened here. So we got the nine life cell, the adrenaline cell, 19 dull arc stones, plus 10 additional ones. Three pristine feathers. It actually gave us three of these rare objects, and it says down only twice. So maybe it was expecting us to get down three times because at this point in time, the max armor and the max weapons you can have is 300 when you first tackle one of these new behemoths. I think all of them are minimum of 300 or 325, and it recommends having a minimum power level in both your armor and weapon slots of 325 here. We also got a neutral furry tooth and a neutral furry plate. Alright guys, well that was the Moonshriever Shrike. If you guys did enjoy today's gameplay and today's video, please leave a like, leave your feedback down below in the comments, subscribe for more if you haven't already, and I will catch y'all later.